Hi there, I'm going to show you how to quickly change the color of the provided icons that you got with your template. Um, sometimes what happens is that we can't find icons that are that match the design in Canva, provided by Canva. You can always go over to Elements and try to find icons that way, but we're always trying to make sure that we're catering to the free option of Canva. And if they don't have a nice free icon, then what we do is we, um, we create our own and then upload it into Canva. So... Um, because we've done that, it becomes an image file, and that image file isn't directly editable in Canva. So what do you do? You're going to take the PNG files that were provided in your folder, in your zip folder, and you're going to bring it into this online program. It's going to take you two seconds to do. You're going to absolutely love it. It's painless, and you're, you know, bookmark this site because this is something that you can use over and over again. So you're going to head over to manytools.org forward slash image forward slash colorize filter. I will put this link in the description below. You're going to double click on your folder here. And once you've found your icon folder, which is included in the product download. So once you're here, you just click on icons and then you'll have options of PNG or AI icons. You want the PNG files. And then you just select whichever one that you want to change. If you want to change all three, you can do this process three times. Um, okay, and now it's brought in, but as you can see, the entire screen is white. So this can be misleading. You might think, oh, it didn't work. It absolutely did work. It's just white on top of a white background, which makes it disappear or look like it's disappeared. But it is there. And then you're going to hit this color chooser. And I want to make mine black. So I'm going to hit, I'm going to select black and then multiply. And by doing that, it's created a filter over the image and that's as easy as it gets. I'm gonna download this. And once it's downloaded, where is this one? Once it's downloaded, you head over to uploads, you upload it like you would any image. And then once it's uploaded, I'm going to select the one that I want to replace and then just drag it into that box and it's going to snap into place. And then you can resize it as you see fit. And it's really that simple. And you can do this again and again and again. And of course, you can do it for any color that you want. You can use your brand colors, anything. Uh, I'm just going to head over here again just to show you how easy it is. You can just go to this tool and just select any color that you want. And it will change it for you. And that's it. Hope that was helpful.